in this question we need to provide the reasons for given statements the first one is leather gets hardened after tanning this is due to the chemical cross linking that occurs during the tanning process tanning agents such as chromium salt or plant tannins they form strong chemical bonds within the collagen fibers in the raw animal hide this cross linking stabilizes the protein structure the cross linking makes the collagen fibers less susceptible to degradation by water and enzymes it results in increased toughness and rigidity the tanning also reduces their ability to absorb water and which helps to leather maintains its shape and hardness the second one is ferric chloride is preferred over potassium chloride in case of cut leading to bleeding this is due to their hemostatic properties that is ferric chloride act as an astringent it react with blood proteins to produce a coagulated layer which help to stop the bleeding by promoting clot formation this property makes it effective in controlling the minor bleeding ferric chloride can oxidize and precipitate the proteins which assist in forming a protective barrier over the wound so potassium chloride on the other hand doesn't have these hemostatic properties and is primarily used as a potassium supplement rather than for wound treatment thus ferric chloride is used in first aid for its ability to promote clotting and control bleeding the third one is friendlich isotherm becomes independent of pressure at high pressure for a gas absorbed on a solid the friendlich isotherm describes how the amount of gas absorbed on a solid surface varies with the pressure of the gas at high pressure the adsorption sites on the solid surface become saturated this means that there are no more available sites for additional gas molecules to other two as a result increasing the pressure further doesn't significantly increase the amount of gas adsorbed the adsorption reaches a maximum value because the surface has limited number of sites once these sites are filled the additional pressure doesn't affect the adsorption making the adsorption amount essentially constant despite increasing in pressure therefore at high pressure the friendlich isotherm flatten out and the amount of gas adsorbed becomes less sensitive to further increases in pressure